Eastern had us 18-12. Uh, we had worked on some different things to try it against, against Eastern. We felt like our game plan was, was really good and our kids played well enough to execute that game plan. Um, number 13 team in the country, so that's a nice big win for us. Um, it got real close at the end. Uh, Eastern has not had the success it's had without absolutely refusing to let that ball hit at the end of the fourth set. We had some difficulty, but we end up we were we got down 25-24, and we end up winning 27-25. So that was a huge win. You know, Eastern's in our region. Um, Mariah Savage at 480 that game with 15 kills. So we're real pleased. We've been waiting for her to have this, a breakout day, and she had one today. It was. It was. It was part of it's part of that game plan, and our, our, our middles are closing the gaps. We, you know, they've got you know, the one of their outsides is the returning player of the year in that division of the you know of the uh, MAC and the Freedom Division. Um, so, you know, we got to try. You got to chop their best players, and you, at least some. And we did a good job of that today. Now that was a, that was a little frustrating, and I got to say, we had this huge crowd, and that crowd I think helped the sales as well, because the sales was dead as I mean, Messiah just just beat them really good, and then the sales decides, oh, we're going to play, and they started passing, and then they started uh, uh, being able to convert and side us out, and so we really had a fight for that game. It was a little frustrating to lose the first one, but then came back and you know 25-11 right after that, and again Mariah had 15 kills, uh, so another really good day for Mar for our Mariah and our team. Because Mar as Mariah knows, we have to pass, and Sarah's got to set it to her because Sarah's basically her setter in that 6-2 offense.